Hey guys, and welcome to another Factorio workshop. As always, I am here with Matt Zuri. Greetings. And today we're going to show you some split offs from your main bus, some some correct, uh, proper split offs to your main bus, because I think a lot of people actually don't know how to do a good one of these, myself included. I know how to do the one and the two, um, but I do not know by heart how to do this four or anything bigger. Uh, so obviously Zuri built this part, um, but yeah. So I think a lot of people don't quite know how to do this, so hopefully this will help you out and we will provide blueprints. I'll provide blueprints for the two and the four because uh, the next one you just use two fours and then the first one is obviously just obvious. So we'll start here. Um, yeah, this one is literally just splitting off one lane. It can't get any simpler. You use a splitter, which is exactly what it's made for. You split half and you're good to go. And yeah, Siri shows there's two different ways you could do this. If you do a red belt, because of the splitter being kind of wonky, it just gives you a half lane. It's still the same amount, uh, but it just gives you half if you, like, for uh, symmetry reasons or whatever, want a full lane, just do like we had and throw down a yellow belt. And, uh, yeah, I'll let you take over the rest of these, Zuri. Well, I'd like to start off by saying this is probably how you do it if you wanted to save UPS. Instead of having untold dozens and hundreds of extra splitters, you just pull a line off as you need them. A lot of builds are uh, designed to consume an entire belt worth. So just peel off an entire belt worth. Yeah, exactly. Just cut it off from the bus, but make sure you do have a balancer beforehand. A uh, four-lane balancer here. Yeah, either that or you're really good at train balancing. <laughs> yeah, that too. We yeah, have two of the two belt designs here. The standard one that pretty much everyone should know or does already. Mm -hmm. And then this one is the same exact thing, except it's placed under itself instead of sticking out the inserter so it fits in its footprint. Right, which can be really nice sometimes if you need that extra, extra bit of room here. Yeah, if you need the extra bit of room, or you just like builds that fit in their own footprint. Mm -hmm. It's kind of the same way with the, the four lane, with the one belt peel off. The one belt split. This is, yeah, one belt off of four for a fully saturated belt, or one quarter of the total throughput. So if you're missing some, I think so, I was safe. For the next one down, you'll get about that much reduction. So you see this is about the same as the input density. Mm -hmm. And each time you peel off, it'll be, again, uh, about a 25% reduction. So this is the, the one that fits in its footprint, and this one doesn't. And they both work the same. Yeah. Yeah, the first one, I think, is a little bit cleaner just in general, but... If you do prefer this, there's this one. And here, if you have multiples of four lanes and you want X number of belts off of them, you could pull one off of each belt. You can even stagger these if you want and then use whatever compression method you want to make sure it's one or two or three or however many belts you need out. You could have six or uh, 12 belts pull one line off of each and then have like a three to two compressor if you really wanted to. Yeah, yeah, that would work. But uh, again, I say it's, uh, it's probably better for your computer if you just peel off two or three lines off of 12 than trying to keep balancing them again and again. But some yeah. people love using these, so if that's your thing, go for it. Yeah, definitely. If you like using them, go for it. But um, the, the computer thing is already said. But also for simplicity, if if you don't like you like if these are just you know kind of complicated and a pain for you to do, uh, then this is just a much simpler method. I mean, if you have eight lanes and you need two full lanes off of it, it's a lot simpler to just literally take these two bottom lanes, right, and just send the whole lanes down, rather than than go through all this. Yep. So yeah, I mean that's pretty much it. I you know these are the the standard ones, and 
Um, we will provide, again, blueprints for the two and the four, um, but the, both, both types of each. And then from those, you can kind of, you know, do whatever you like with them and however big you need. But uh, hopefully that will help for anyone who, who doesn't or didn't really know how to make these, myself included. But uh, yeah, unless there's anything else you have to add, Zuri, I think that'll be it. A bit of a shorter one today. Oh, not much to add. Just another tool for the tool belt. Yeah, definitely. All right, guys. As always, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Love to hear your thoughts uh, down in the comments and any submissions. And until next time, we will catch you later. Later.